Now at six, breaking news. The search continues for a group of smash and grab burglars who pulled off a heist in Beverly Hills and it was all caught on camera. CBS 2's Joy Benedict is live outside that jewelry store with details on a bold burglary, Joy. Yeah, Pat, I mean, this one was really hard for a lot of folks to watch out here on a very busy South Beverly Boulevard at about 1.45 in the afternoon. You can see a few hours later, they have cleaned up the glass, but there is still a lot to do to fix the damage here after a brazen crime was caught on tape. Gunshots. I thought it was gunshots. I told everyone to get on the floor. This store owner didn't know what was happening when a group of people shattered his front window on South Beverly Boulevard. I come outside and I see the guys banging on the window with crowbars and sledgehammers, and they're right by me. Wesley Aframian owns the business next door. They're starting to run. I push them into the street. He drops a few watches maybe save them 50, 60, 70 thousand dollars with that. The Beverly Hills Police Department says it all happened at 1:45 in broad daylight when what appears to be a group of men got out of an SUV, approached the window, smashed it in and grabbed everything in sight. Of course, numerous people had their cell phones rolling. Good people trying to make a living and someone just comes, robs them, takes their whole livelihood. It's a shame. Those with businesses in the area are in shock. But they say not surprised. We shouldn't be on the news for like crime seen happening in Beverly Hills. This is really upsetting. I think we need more officers walking the streets. But for the owner who has run luxury jewels of Beverly Hills for 15 years, he says despite the loss, he is thankful that he still has what matters most. Happy no one's hurt. That's all that matters. Honestly. So these are my family, my employees, they're like my family. So as long as no one's hurt. It's fine. Certainly hard to hear that, but yes, what matters most is everyone's safety and everyone is okay despite this very brazen robbery. Now, the Beverly Hills Police Department says they are looking for at least five individuals. Again, they arrived in a stolen vehicle stolen out of Long Beach. That's all we know. And they left in possibly another vehicle. So right now, they are looking through security video and they're actually asking for help for so many people who grabbed that cell phone footage. If you've seen anything, if you've heard anything, if you've heard anything since, you're urged to contact the police department. Pat. All right. Thanks so much, Joy.